shit, I'm about to dump my shoulder in here. <laughs> I ain't playing with it. I don't even know how cold it is. It's just the morning time. I don't even know if she was ice like that. It's fucking ice around the edges, bro. Oh, shit. You definitely gotta get in here. You want to just, you gotta get your shoulders though, because you want, you know what I mean? Don't play with me. Yeah, she gotta get her shoulders in there, bro. I'm just doing my hair wet. Shit, hair wet? Yeah. Put the mushroom in here. Oh, shit. I'm going like two, bro. Oh, he's just putting his arm in. Put my shoulder, my shit's sore, you know what I mean? I thought he was giving you an opportunity right now. People are most definitely playing right now. Who are you? <laughs> Fuck. Shit cold as a motherfucker. You told me to push him in there? <laughs> <laughs> he trying to die. He's trying to die. You gonna die if you push me in there. Uh, wait, you Boy two. So, <laughs> what is going on guys? Hope the vacuum don't be too loud. You can hear me. But I just wanna talk a little about being the owner, the responsibilities you gotta do, the stuff you gotta get done. You know what I mean? Because if you don't do it, it ain't gonna get done. Unless you hire people to do it, right? I feel like, I feel like the Sunday just got vacuumed everything in here. Everything just get tracked right in here, especially the winter time. Just gotta make sure we get everything. Everything. Make sure we get everything. Business owner, it's it's pros and cons to it. It's like everything else. But I feel like if you love it, you don't really, it don't really affect the cons of being like a business owner. You know what I mean? Like you gotta legitimately love this. If you don't love this, what are you doing it for? Like, what's the growth you getting from it? Like, you, like, where you trying to go with it? You know what I mean, that's where I'm at right now. Just spreading my wings, getting as much knowledge as I can. You know, going big with it. Going big. The so fuck you don't go big with it? What's the point of doing it? You know what I mean? So let's try to get as much knowledge as I possibly can <clears throat> to, you know, to do what I gotta do to get it done. Nobody ain't gonna do this shit for you. Like I said before. It's like t having a business like taking care of a kid, honestly. I feel like it. I ain't have a kid, but 
I got like here, I got like a hundred. I like 400 kids, 400 members, 400 members. We got people that gotta get paid for their time. You know what I mean? Paying people for their time is a big thing. Big thing. Cause nobody working for free. Nobody working for free. Unless you're the boss. The boss work for free. Because you gotta you gotta work for free to make your dreams. To make your dreams come true, you know? You gotta do it for free for a bit. You know? I paid myself, but is what I wanna get paid? Nah, pay myself because help me out on the books. Help me out on the books. Oh, just doing a little thing. Why well, is it a good thing to get uncomfortable though? Why should everybody get uncomfortable? I think people should get uncomfortable if they want to grow. You know what I mean? If you don't want to grow, what are we doing here? Doing here as a human. What are we doing? Like, why we ain't trying to progress? Trying to level up. Mm -hmm. I think the best way to go is up. I like to go up. I don't know about some people. But the realistic thing is up, challenges, down, even worse challenges. I'd rather be up to have like more challenges I have control over. When you're down, I feel like you less less challenges, less control over. You know what I mean? So, gotta have challenges, gotta do shit. The thing is, some people are lazy too. Some people are just like doing shit because money involved. I'm like, I think one too, that's another thing too. Like, you own like a business. Nobody will never love your shit as much as you love your shit. Cause they don't really give a fuck unless you're paying them, right? People only care if they're getting paid to do some shit. Like, I genuinely love getting motherfuckers fit, man. Genuinely love it. You know what I mean? Like, what the fuck? I feel like if you genuinely don't love getting somebody fit or doing, being a trainer, specifically, like, what are you doing it for, bro? Cause you gotta, like, you end up becoming a friend with that, like, client. I mean, I got all type of clients, so, you know what I mean? Especially online. The like, online clients. They like to grow. I might not never meet them in person. Hopefully I can. Hopefully I can meet all my online clients in person. You know what I mean? That's the best thing. Is like meeting somebody, and like empowering somebody, giving them knowledge. Those are like the best times. You know what I mean? It's helping somebody grow. Not too many people out there want to help other people grow. They want to keep people down, keep people manipulated. You know? Yeah. So, life.
wife, man. Life is a bitch sometimes. And it's not. It's a bitch sometimes. It's like, it's a good motherfucking thing to live. This is when you hit that, hit the hard shit. Quit the hard shit. Make a question, do you want to be here anymore? You know what I mean? I like the hard shit, cause it's like, the hard shit molds you a little more, but you be like, fuck, why is this happening to me? You know what I mean? It's like everything like a circle though. It's like a circle. You do one thing one way, you try to do another way, shit hits you. Shit hits you, man. You know what I mean? Shit hits you hard sometimes. Some people know how to react to it. Some people stay down. When life hit me, man, I'm like, fuck that. I'm gonna fight back. However I can, you know what I mean? Well, you gotta stay up, protect your energy. I feel like when you like successful and what you love to do, motherfuckers will try to like take you out, swear to God. Try to take you out. I don't know why people like that, man. I think they're not happy where they at in life, so they want you to be miserable where you at. You no, know, one thing about me, I was I don't have this fence up, but I have this energy vibe thing. Some people are like we're really weird to read. I don't know why, man. Some people are really weird to read. But I feel like God like put them in your life, so like you be like, oh shit, you know what I mean? You never know what that person's true colors is. So like that shit really show. You know what I mean? But being around a mixed amount of people, you gonna see somebody's true colors. I see somebody should cover sometime. It's, it's gonna come. It's gonna come a day and a time. And that shit all come out. That shit never fails, swear to God. Never fails. Every person that did me wrong or, you know, try to violate me, try to. Shander, shander my, my character. It's always come out, man. It's come out. I try to do nothing but good for people, man. But you only could do so much as a human. You know what I mean? Folks do not care. Fuckers do not care. But it's all good. Motherfucker gonna live and see another day. If I don't, it is what it is, man. As long as you happy, happy what you're doing, happy to be living, you'll be fine. It'll be fine. But for them, their time will come back around. Their time will come back around. But also, too, everybody grows at different rates and speeds. People grow differently. Sometimes it's just, sometimes it's just you have time to end. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's just a time to end. That relationship, that chapter, Move on, spin. But also, if you move on, you don't gotta talk shit about nobody, man. You don't. You 
No, at all. We got to shit about no one. What we do? I feel like people don't talk shit. People just like gossip. Yeah. I call myself a couple times gossiping about someone, but I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? Like, what am I doing, bro? Talking about this other human. You know what I mean? You got no business talking about another human. But the best part about growing today, like this generation, being a millennium, is like, this is so much, bro, so much. So much stuff going on. So much stuff going on in the world today. So much, so much knowledge. So much stuff to grasp. So much exposure. Good, bad, all type of exposure, you know what I mean? Play this all type of exposure. Could be bad exposure, good exposure. You know what I mean, when I really started going like viral, you know what I mean, people was like, oh, what the fuck is he doing? He going against the rules. He not supposed to do that. What is he doing? You know what I mean? But being me, I ain't give no effity. Fevity fucks. You know, like, who are you? I am him. I am me. You are you. You know what I mean? There's nobody. Like, let people be them. Let people grow. You know what I mean? I remember when I was, like, in special ed and stuff. Like, I was in special ed. I had, like, a, le a learning disability. And um, people used to make fun of me all the time. People made fun of me all the time. It is what it is, you know? That's good they made fun of me. Because, like, nobody can ever, like, I can never feel bad, you know, about the shit I do. Who gonna make fun of you? Who gonna bully you? People going to judge you. People gonna, people always, man, I don't give a fuck, man. I don't. I don't, bro. You know, I don't give a fuck because my life is fucked up raising, huh? They still fucked up, man. Bastard. I'm a bastard child. But who cares? Who cares, right? You live, you learn. We back live, baby. Set you up for success. No more vacuum. Now it's time to mop. I might try to do like every, like every, Okay, every, I'm trying to think. Like at every, damn. I'm trying to see every. I'm trying to think, guys, my bad. Like my bad. I think about some other shit while I'm trying to think. It's like brown being fucking on it sometimes. Got so much shit going on, yeah. I might do like, cause Thursday, Tuesday, I stay late at the gym, so I might do like, fucking just shoot the shits Tuesday, Thursdays. 
shoot the shits Tuesday, Thursdays. How that sound? You know what else too, man? You know somebody a fucking real worker when you don't gotta when you don't gotta tell motherfuckers to do fucking little things, bro. Like real motherfucker, like yo, I just want me to mop. Like, swear to God, when I was a trainer, I was training at this one gym. I mean, super dirty. I ain't gonna say the gym, but it was dirty as fuck. I keep my shit up to par, but them wasn't it. But anyway, I ain't asked no questions. You know what I mean? I just knew just off the work ethic to what the fuck and do. You know what I mean? Like, if I'm a trainer at a gym, I see something is not going or something is not, something is not fucking, like, something is off or something is out of place. Fuck them, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fix this shit. Without the owner's permission. You know what I mean? If I need the owner's permission, I'm gonna ask permission to fucking. The fucking, yo, know, where's the clean? Like, if I need something, like, I can't find something. Like, yo, where's the fucking cleaner shit? Where's this? Where's where that? You know what I mean? It's only thing I'm gonna ask some motherfucker for. Ask some motherfucker for nothing really else. Like, yo, where the fuck? Like, yo, where the cleaning? Like, how can I? You know what I mean? No, some people build different, bro. But I just think it's how I grow up, but fucking hustler, bro. Fucking hustler. Nobody got that hustle mentality. So I started realizing doing what I do, be, be what I be. It's a fucking 1%. Like, it's like the only motherfucker around me who got my mentality, you know what I mean? I think a lot of people don't. Don't fucking like think like that. I don't be a dog. <sighs> I'll be on stage. <sighs> so this is a hold it quartet. Tell me money, bro. Big bread. Big bread. Hey, Audi. We'll go to the front, mop up. I'll take you guys with me. Yeah, we on the cami. This light right here is a motion detector, so hopefully that should work right now. Cut, cut. Oh. Oh. Cut the light off. Turn off the lights in here, baby. Uh, 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 I like that song right there. That song right there. Look at that shit in my throat. Shit in my throat trying to choke me out, boy. Hey, you guys, just finished cleaning up. About to head out of here. It's a nice little quick clean session. We should stay clean, but that's impossible. You own a business. But um, we're out of here. And I got to take my black ass home. I right, love y'all. Peace. Said I was get hurt. Said home. <laughs>